So I decided to go for the foundation apprenticeship as I felt it was a good route to get into GE here as I'd done my work experience. So I done the foundation and it gave me kind of the good building blocks to go for a probably for a modern apprenticeship. It was a wee bit of a learning curve, um, and I think that's to be expected. It's a new environment, different kind of learning styles, different teaching styles for the lecturers. I think it was a, I think it's a good good change for people, especially coming from school, you know, can build your skill set to to help going forward forward for more employers. I was in the kind of like one of the first cohorts of the, the FA and then at the end of my first year, so halfway through it, I seen the uh, the advertisement for in here to be an apprentice. So uh, nobody had really kinda of done it before but I, I kind of seen that I had I was getting from the foundation what I needed for the, the entry requirements in here and I applied. Um, and it kind of just kinda of went from there. But once I get offered the position, they wanted me to finish the foundation, so I kind of had that year deferred entry. Um, but yeah, it worked, worked out perfect really. Yeah. Uh, the biggest difference was just again the environment and that you're actually in doing in aircraft engines, whereas in college it was kind of core units like your wiring and whatnot or machining, whatever it might have been. But I think it's just you can't really replicate the work in here per se, but you can pick up, as you say, the hand skills and kind of transfer them. But I think it was definitely an advantage anyway, because it gave you a, a good understanding coming into the modern apprenticeship. The three-year apprenticeship, we try to give you a whole range of the business, so you get to see some different support functions, like the health and safety department, quality departments, things like that. And then you can move on into the shop floor and actually working on the, the engines and the strip side and the build side, so you get a good comprehensive kind of knowledge base for the full factory so it gives you a good understanding of why certain areas do things certain ways. Yeah. I've finished mine in the log books and things but I was kind of a bit different. There was an, an area of one of the support functions in the calibration team and uh, there was like a vacancy and no one was doing that. There was no, so that had a kind of big impact in our production so they needed somebody in there so uh, I get put into there and kind of got my stamp early so I could start doing that job as an apprentice. So it kind of worked a bit different for me and so I didn't follow that top three choices. I made the decision I wanted to go in there. So and it's and it's worked too well. It's given me loads of new skills and different understanding again of the business and how it works. In different areas I might not usually do as a as a mechanic. So yeah I've had uh, I'd like to think a good apprenticeship, uh, both foundation and modern. Uh, one, I think it was maybe 2018, the Foundation Apprentice of the Year and the Scottish Apprentice of the Year. So it was, it was a good experience and it gave me a good platform to bounce off and again meet new people and share experiences and stories and try and uh, help each other's apprenticeship programmes in different ways. And it was a kind of new progressive path for foundations into modern apprenticeships. It had never been done before. I was the first person to kind of, you know, kind of tread that path and it, and it worked out well for me so it gave a good opportunity for any school leavers so employers like GE here can tap into that school leaver market instead of just going from college or whatever else people may have applied from so I think it really opened a, a big pool of talent especially in the foundations that you've spoke to today they might not have had that opportunity to come directly into the workplace and I think maybe that was the reason. I would recommend doing it as, as long as you're going to enjoy it and it might be that it will help you. It, give, it certainly helped me, it gave me loads of skills and opportunities to do things so I'd recommend going for it, speak to whoever you want to speak to, family, guidance teachers, teachers, seek advice and if it's right for you definitely go for it because it, you never know it might help you land your foundation, it might help you get your modern apprenticeship or whatnot. I'd always had a, an interest in the aviation in, industry and I'd done my work experience here back in I think it was third year or something at school and once I got into the environment I just thoroughly enjoyed it and ever since that kind of moment and that experience with GE it was right that's where I want to go, that's how did I get there, that's why I've done the foundation and it's just it's a great working environment the apprentice programme here is I'd like to say very well renowned, it's very good, we've got high calibre of apprentices coming here and we've always got uh, great opportunities for folk going forward. There's a lot of the senior leadership team have been through an apprenticeship, some have been through apprenticeships here 
So there's a good progression in the company as well for apprentices to move forward.